Hello YouTube, just Little Mr. Hardcore, aka Robert with Sun. Got a uh, one TTM mail day, but I picked up some other stuff, so I figured I'd show that off too. First off, I found this at my go my local Goodwill. It's called Standing Firm Dan Quail. It's got like someone gashed it with something on the front and back, but I was going through some few books and saw this, and now I can't even open it. Ah. Come on, there it is. Vice President Memoir, Dan Quayle. So I thought that was cool. Got to pick that up. Then we were, when I was getting my chibis at the Target, I saw this. It's uh, Press Pass Legends. Get, gets an HRA and stuff like that. And NASCAR. And then you get one pack with a memorabilia card in every box. And it was on sale normally, I think, 20 And I got it for 12 and I end up getting the guy that's local from here, Tim Richmond, fire suit card, numbered to 199, which is awesome. He has passed away. Most people, most people who like NASCAR know who he is, but that card is awesome to me, especially him being from my hometown. And then I bought one of these. This was also uh, in the sales section, so I got it for 12 bucks, which. Even though he signs anything and everything, the set with, well, it's packs. You get 10 packs, and then you get one of these autographs of Pete Rose. I didn't have a Pete Rose, so I thought, what the hey, for 12 bucks. So there's that. And now let's get into the TTM coming from, as some would say, Santa Claus, California. And I'll go on and get into it and see who it is. And uh, I don't get this. This is Ned Beatty, and he only he I don't get it. This is weird. I did get Ned Beatty. But he wrote on the back of a couple and didn't sign them. But I got this one. It says, Dueling Guitars. Who is playing the lead here? I'm the... Carist? Got contest? I'm not sure what that is. That's on the back of this. I don't know why he did that. Uh, this one he did not do anything to. Oh, uh, nope. He wrote an N, and then he stopped. He started writing N right there, and then there's nothing. And no signature on the back. This one says, th this is the picture. And it's the deliverance cover, and it says, this is the only one he signed. It says, this looks kind of scary, Ned Beatty, deliverance. And then this one is a picture of them two in the boat. I'm sorry if there's a glare, but it says, No, you can't have my paddle. It's my paddle, and you can't. I don't care. Bert says it is mine. Oh, so he's writing what he says in the movie, I guess. But he didn't sign it except for that one, so I might be able to put a picture and then flip that one back backwards or something. It was kind of weird. I don't know. But I did get Ned Beatty, and uh, that's been a long time ago, I think. I just don't understand why he signed like that. I normally don't get those ones with the on the back. Uh, looking in my book for Ned Beatty. Uh, I'm not seeing him, but I know I sent to him. I remember that now. But And I sent four, which normally I do not do. I probably just couldn't decide on... I'm not seeing him, which really sucks. But I know I sent to um, Ned B. Ah, uh, come on. Ned, I'm not seeing you in my book, which is starting to make me mad. I, I need to figure out a better way to to figure out who I sent to while I'm in. Because I, I want to do it live, but I don't want to sit here boring people out of their mind listening to me look for Ned Beatty. I can't I didn't find him. I don't know. I'll look later. 
But anyways, Ned Beatty, I guess. He signed one on the back. Better than nothing. So that's what I got. Hope you enjoyed it and all that stuff. Pete Rose. Woo! And the Dan Quayle. So thanks for watching. Bye! Bye.